Hey everybody, this is a great way to try four different wines from all over the world. These are red wines that are great for grilling. They're perfect for summer. I always love the smoky, kind of rich, savory quality that you can sometimes get in red wines. And what I did is I picked four wines that share that common smoky quality. Uh, we have a Ribera del Duero from Spain, a Malbec from Argentina. One of my favorite grapes, this grape called Syrah, can, can really give you that smoky, peppery quality that's perfect for grilling. And then uh, another grape called Grenache, which is blended with Morvedra. This is a really great way for you to try four rich reds that are smoky and perfect for summer grilling. This Ribera del, del Duero is from the Castilla Leon region of the northern part of Spain. And it's a really beautiful example of a, a deep and concentrated uh, red wine. So on the color, we have this deep ruby and then the nose it's concentrated with black plums and coconut and vanilla and cedar. It's a grape called Tinto de Tinto del País, which is also known as Tempranillo. It's one of the most important and celebrated red grapes of Spain. Thinking about smoking um, some like ribs or making um, pulled pork this summer, having something that is concentrated and braised or cooked down, and this one would be a perfect pairing. And I love how the nose smells smoky, but the smokiness is coming from oak. So you get that charred, almost um, coconut, bourbon type smell. It's a really elegant wine, despite all of its concentration and flavor. Mm. So good. So the Thunavan Calvé La Moret is a beautiful red wine that's very smoky and delicious. It's a blend of a grape called Grenache, which is my favorite red grape, and another blending grape called Morvedra. And these two grapes are coming from this region near um, a town called Maury, which is in the Roussillon region of France. So in the southern part of France, you have the sun-kissed, beautiful red fruits that smell concentrated and rustic and um, really deep in, on the nose and have a, a meatiness and a, and a smoky quality that's intense and, and very like draws you in. It's a fuller flavored wine with a lot of rich, intense um, red and black plums that are almost sappy and drenched and, and juicy. The wine is a uh, medium to medium plus in body and has this really long finish. Um, it, this is a perfect red wine if you're making barbecued spare ribs or any of those like sweet and savory um, barbecue sauces. So this is perfect for your summer grilling. One of my favorite grapes is a grape called Syrah. And this is the Lunar Apogee, which is a Syrah from a little village right outside of uh, the region of Avignon, which is in the Rhone Valley near chateauneuf du pape And this is just north of the Rhone Valley. Um, of Avignon rather, and it's a Syrah, 100%. What I love about this wine is it's a really nice example of an elegant and yet smoky and concentrated red wine. So when you look at the wine, you have like a lighter color than most Syrahs. It has a slightly garnet uh, hue or color. And when you smell it, it's what I would call a typical Syrah. So it has um, crunchy red fruit. Uh, what does that mean? It just means like tart, almost cranberries, that have a dried and savory quality to them. And there's this pepper, both black pepper, white pepper, that adds a smokiness to the wine. That when you think about grilling a ribeye steak, maybe putting some black pepper on it, this would be a really perfect uh, complement to that. So, I also love the saltiness of the wine. It has almost like a briny olive quality and a smoked meat quality, which is just really elegant and somehow lifted, yet really refreshing. Rounding out this tasting of smoky and rich reds that are perfect for summer is Loriano Malbec. And this Malbec is coming from a region called Uco Valley in Mendoza in Argentina. Um, this is a perfect wine for a really big, full flavored barbecue. If you're thinking about grilling some ribeye steaks and you want a soft and supple wine that's uh, just generous in fruit and yet has a lot of structure. This is a perfect wine for you. So 
I love Malbec. It is one of my um, most popular grapes. It's always uh, a grape that people ask for at our wine bars because it's a crowd pleaser. And this one is a boutique property and you can smell this really high tone and that means like it gets up in your nose blue fruit and blueberries and has a lot of like violets in a concentrated almost brambly way when you taste it it's like the body of a cab without the drying and dusty tannin so it's a really full flavored wine i hope you enjoy these tastings and these videos and please let us know um, your comments till next time cheers